heaps. We have sea grapes and we're gonna be doing ASMR, but first we're gonna show you how we make them. And there's an extra at the end of the video, so stick around. These are the sea grapes. So we put them in the water and we're gonna soak them in the water for three minutes. Starting my timer. Okay. Um, 30 seconds left to go. Water with a little bit of ice that's melted for a little. Transition them into that bowl. So that's about it, but you have to let them rest for three more minutes. And then they come out like this. Um, we're gonna finish this batch, and then we'll be right back with the ASMR. Hey! Uh, we're back with the sea grapes, and this is how they turned out. They turned out pretty nice, I do say so myself. Uh, there's a little bit of water on the plate, so I, I have this island dressing that came with it. So I'm just going to dig in. This is my first time trying them, so I'm kind of scared. Okay, they're not that bad. They're just really interesting. I don't think I like that. <laughs> but we're gonna eat them all anyway. I hope they don't make me sick. Here goes a big one. I don't like it. Can I stop? <laughs> They taste really musky. Can I stop? Try it with the Thousand Island. Okay, good idea. Oh. Now that's good. Now it kind of just tastes like a salad. It's kind of sweet too. A sea grape salad? No, it just tastes like a salad. But with little poppies in it. I have to put like a lot of dressing on it because it kind of grows. I'm putting more dressing on my plate because honestly this dressing's really good and it tastes better with the sea grapes because it kind of like makes it sweeter instead of muskier like I don't know 
kind of less bitter. I stared at the light, now I can't see. <laughs> That's essential. They're very crunchy, huh? Mm hmm. Frank mini grapes. Don't laugh at me. A little juicier. So, better with Thousand Island? Way better. You want to try? Is it better? Is that a yak? <laughs> Is that a yak? Is it better? Yes. They're really pretty good with that dressing. We need a sea grape then. With some ranch. Spaghetti of the sea. Mm. Uh, just drop that in there. <laughs> Oh, look, I got a sea grape on my tooth. No? Mm, my teeth. Oh, you mix it I mixed it. Now time for the special. It's a homemade onigiri by me because why not? Um, it's made with pickled plums, rice, and seaweed. Um, I messed up a little, so it's not perfect, but I'm still excited. So I'm going to unwrap it. Bottom's falling apart a little. Not too bad. <coughs> I'm gonna lift it and put it on the plate now. This is the onigiri. I made it in a little ball because I'm not too talented. But I tried. Seaweed and rice. Is that good? <coughs> Has it stopped recording?
it's not bad. I haven't gotten to the pickled plum part because it was like right in the middle. And this is a thick ball. And the seaweed's kind of meh and it's falling apart real bad. Well, that's all for this video, guys. Um, like and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that notification button. And hope you had a nice time watching. Bye-bye.